Let's start. Today we will see how to implement the read-only text field in Flutter Android. Let's see the main.dart file. First, we import the material.dart package. Then, in the main function, we create the stateless widget called myApp. This is the myApp stateless widget. In the build function, we create a material app and apply a theme. The home attribute is set to a stateful widget called my home page. This is the my home page stateful widget. Here we create a state object of this stateful widget, whose name is underscore my home page state. This is underscore my home page state class, here we will design our app. In the build function, first, we call the scaffold widget, which is the base, upon which we will draw other widgets. The app bar attribute is set to the app bar widget. Here we use our title variable as the title of this app bar. Then we set the body attribute to the center widget. In the center widget, we have a text field. We set the read-only attribute to true. Also, we set some default initial value of the text field using the controller. Let's run the app. As you can see, no matter what I do, I cannot change the contents of the text field. As even if I click the text field, the keyboard does not appear. So that's it. That's how you can implement the read-only text field in Flutter Android. Thank you.